What's up, guys? I'm a military dude. This is gonna be a video of my World War II officer's long coat. Uh, I picked this up about two years ago at a reenactment. I paid around thirty-five dollars for it, and uh, yeah, it's really awesome. It shows some sign of wear, which I like, but it's not like you know too worn out. But here's the button buttons. All of them are on there. Shot the outside. The pockets are different from the regular GI issued ones. They got this more, I don't know what you call it, lining, I guess. It's not like a wool lining. Some other weird material. It's really cool. That's on both pockets, too. There we go. Then opening it up. Right here. This is the got like a lining in it, like a nylon almost. Over here you got buttons to close the pockets for like the lining. And right here you can see. Put that out in the light. Army officer's overcoat. And it does got the guy's name. Right here you can see some signs of stains. And then his name's up there, Major Whitehead. This right here has been pretty worn down. But yeah, overall the condition on the inside is really nice. And then let me show you the pocket here. This, one uh, this little pocket right here. Let's see. Right there. Company that made it. Now let me show you the date. I'm going to set you guys down for a sec. It's hard. Alright, there you go. It should be. Alright, so this is the date. Day August 11, 1942. It's a 40R short. Yep, length of the short, size 40. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll show you the back side of it. It does have epaulets with buttons on both sides. Let's see. Put this around. Alright. Right here, this, both buttons attached. Has like the lining material. And in the back here, it's. So, it's missing one of the buttons here to close up the back, but that's okay. That's the top one. This one's, well, not technically, no, this one's my bad. The bottom one's technically missing, but I just found out it's stuck in there. So I'll sew that back later on today, but that, that's kind of funny. And then the other one's completely missing. So there is a replacement button on the inside, so I might put that out, put that on there. But um, yeah, guys, that's it. And see you guys in the next video.